sharp teeth, furry bodies, and a reputation for being disease carriers. It's no surprise why so many people are terrified of rodents. Today, we present you with 10 of the worst rodent attacks. Rats, squirrels, mice, or beavers are all mammals belonging to the Rodentia order, and they're often referred to as rodents. Their names derive from the Latin rodeer, which means to gnaw. The main characteristic that all these animals share is the single pair of continuously growing incisors in each of their lower and upper jaws. Rodents use their incisors to gnaw food, defend themselves, or excavate burrows. Some of them live in trees, some dig burrows, and others are semi-aquatic. The majority of them have short limbs, robust bodies, and long tails. A number of rodent species are serious pests as they eat or spoil foods stored by humans. Other species, such as rats, are notorious for spreading disease. There have also been cases in which rodents have repeatedly gnawed at humans. Number 10. Woman Attacked by a Rabid Beaver 67-year-old Betsy Bent had been paddleboarding on Beaver Lake in North Carolina for over two decades and never faced any problems until July 2016, when she was attacked by a beaver after falling off her board. The rodent latched onto her leg and started biting into it. A fisherman nearby saw the incident and knocked the beaver off her twice, but it kept attacking. Ultimately chased away, Betsy needed several stitches and staples for her lacerations. It was assumed the beaver was rabid, so she was also given a series of shots to combat the disease. Rabies usually manifests itself through fever, insomnia, confusion, hallucinations, and slight or partial paralysis. If left untreated, death occurs in a few days. Number 9. Squirrel Terrorizes California Neighborhood an elderly couple from California were hospitalized with deep cuts and scratches after a bout with a vicious squirrel in their garage. 87-year-old Richard Williams was doing chores when the squirrel slipped through the door and pounced on him. It scratched his head, arms, and legs and kept charging at him whenever it was thrown off. When Norma Williams heard her husband's screams, she took a broom and tried to chase away the squirrel, but it jumped on her and scratched her hands. The Williams managed to grab the squirrel by the tail and slam it against the garage door. It was temporarily stunned, but ran away. The same squirrel was reportedly involved in attacks on eight other people over the course of three weeks. One of the victims was an elementary school teacher. The squirrel entered the classroom, ran up her leg, and bit her on the shoulder. Afterwards, it bit a child from another classroom. The time frame and area where the attacks took place led many to believe that it was the same culprit. Number 8. Baby Covered in Rat Bites A couple from Arkansas were taken into police custody in May 2017 after their newborn daughter was found with numerous rat bites all over her body. 18-year-old Charles Elliott and his girlfriend, Erica Shyrock, 19, were charged with first-degree endangering the welfare of a minor. Shyrock told the police that she placed her daughter in her bassinet at 5.30 a.m. and awoke two hours later to the sound of her screams. When she went to check on her, the 19-year-old mother found the baby covered in blood and called the authorities. An emergency nurse said that the girl weighed about five pounds and was 15 days old. 75 to 100 rat bites covered her entire body, including her face, arms, hands, and fingers. The most significant injury, however, was a gash on her forehead, around one inch wide. The wound was so deep that part of the baby's skull was exposed. Police searched the couple's home and recovered a baby blanket, a blood-soaked hat, and the crib that was covered in bloody rodent paw prints. After more questioning, police found that not only had they known their home was rat-infested, but also that their baby had been bitten before. They hadn't reported it out of fear that they'd lose custody. Number 7. New Type of Deadly Virus 
three squirrel breeders from Germany died after contracting a new strain of virus from their rodents. They developed encephalitis, a brain inflammation which causes confusion, chills, fever, weakness and difficulty walking. After an initial analysis, more elaborate tests were performed. A previously unknown virus was found in a squirrel and brain samples from the three dead men. Their work breeding variegated squirrels, an exotic species native to Central America and Mexico, sometimes resulted in them being scratched or bitten, and that's how the virus was transmitted. One of the men even showed traces of the virus in his blood and spinal fluid. This was proof that the virus had most likely been responsible for the men's deaths. The new strain is called VSBV1, variegated squirrel born a virus, and is similar to a type of virus found in horses and sheep. Number 6. Rats Attack Paraplegic Girl In a scene resembling one from a horror movie, a man from Roubaix, northeastern France, found his paraplegic teenage daughter lying in a pool of her own blood. Initially, the distraught father thought that she'd been the victim of a robbery gone wrong and couldn't identify the source of the blood. He later found out that a pack of rats had descended on the girl as she slept and started gnawing at her body. Because of her condition, 14-year-old Samantha is less sensitive to pain and hadn't been aware of what was happening to her. Her father found her drenched in blood, with numerous lesions on her hands, legs, neck, and face. As she slept, Samantha sustained 30 wounds to her feet, 45 to her face, and 150 wounds across her hands, with extensive damage to the fingertips. Samantha's father filed a negligence complaint against their landlord, stating that a large pile of garbage in the driveway had attracted the rodents. Number 5. Fisherman Killed by Beaver while on a fishing trip at Lake Sheshtakov, Belarus, a 60-year-old man died after being bitten by a beaver, according to the man's friends who joined him on the trip. He approached the animal, intent on taking a picture. The beaver attacked the man and sunk its teeth in his thighs, severing a major artery. His friends struggled to stop the bleeding by applying improvised tourniquets, and the man was taken to a clinic in the village of Ostromokevo. Unfortunately, he lost too much blood and was pronounced dead on arrival. So far, the man is the only person from Belarus known to have died from a beaver attack. Wildlife experts claim that even though beaver attacks are rare, when they do take place, it usually involves an animal that's rabid. Number 4. True Sani when Zhu Sani from Chengdao, Shandong Province, China was just a baby, she went through a horrifying experience that left her disfigured. Her father was mentally ill and would often leave the house for days on end. One day, her mother also went out to get food and didn't come back for three days. Days. Even though she was an infant, Chu Sani was left to fend for herself when she returned. Her mother found the baby crying in a pool of her own blood. Mice had eaten off her nose and upper lip. Her parents didn't have money to pay for surgery and just washed her wounds. At 23, the Qingdao Boshi Hospital offered to provide Chu free surgeries as well as build her an artificial nose and lip. Number 3. Rats Chew Off Baby's Face When a teenage mother from Mexico returned home after going to a party, she went to check on her four-month-old daughter. As 18-year-old Lisbeth Geronima Fuentes Monguea got closer to the baby's crib, a gruesome sight began to unfold before her eyes. She saw her daughter's body bloodied and disfigured. Rats had descended upon the child and mauled her, chewing off her fingers and face. Monguea's mother had been babysitting the child at the time of the attack. Both women were arrested on suspicion of neglect. Number 2. Arun Sanduka 53-year-old Indian man Aaron Sanduka was suffering from pneumonia and admitted to the emergency ward of a local hospital in Kolkata, West Bengal. When his family came to visit him, Aaron was covered in blood and in great pain. Bishwanath, one of Aaron's relatives, described the horrifying scene. No nurse was nearby and he was writhing in pain. His penis had been nibbled by rats. His wounds were so severe, he died later that day. The hospital authorities, who would later face legal action, admitted to rats being inside the ward. Number 1. The Black Death 
The Black Death is often described as one of the deadliest events in human history. The devastating pandemic ravaged Eurasia, claiming anywhere from 75 to 200 million lives, peaking in Europe between 1346 and 1353. Although the origin and causes of the Black Death are the subject of competing theories, DNA analysis suggests that the pathogen responsible for the catastrophe was a bacterium called Yersinia pestis. It developed into several forms, including the bubonic plague, and was transmitted through the air from person to person, but also through the bite of infected rats or fleas. Rats were present in large numbers all over the world, and they carried fleas wherever they went, and because they stowed away on ships, and that's how the deadly bacterium spread. It's estimated at least one third of Europe's total population was killed by the outbreak. The Black Death was named after the black boils that covered the body of an infected infected person. Death was the final stage. Aside from the painful black boils oozing blood and pus, victims would also experience chills, fever, vomiting, diarrhea, terrible aches and pains as well as being completely ostracized from society. There were even entire plague colonies where sufferers were sent to die in mass. The Black Death was incredibly contagious. People could go to bed perfectly healthy at night, and when the morning came, they were dead. It plunged Europe into chaos and panic, creating a series of economic, social, and religious upheavals that shaped the course of European history, all because of a few rats. Hey guys, it's Angelo Cruz of this channel. I wanted to let you all know I've set up a Patreon account where I'll be offering very exciting and very exclusive bonus footage available only to people on Patreon. There, your voice will be heard regarding things you want to see and which direction I take my channel. Click on the end screen here to find out more or on the link in the description below. Thanks guys and I hope to see you on Patreon soon.